Hello everyone. I am Prithvi Chekar. Very glad to be here with you all today. It is a honor to share the stage with other eminent achievers and celebrities like Chekar Kapoor, Pavitra Chara, Doc, Dan and Bob. It was amazing to watch Sahana playing those instruments. Let me introduce myself. I was born with a hearing impairment but was a happy child playing with my elder brother Praveen. But I did not feel any difference except I was the only one wearing a hearing aid machine in my body with wire connecting to my ears. At the age of four, I started studying in a special school, Bala Vijayalaya. All was okay, but students were lying at me. At the age of six, I studied in the mainstream school in Bala Vijaya Mandir. But the major thing was, I was the only one person wearing a hearing aid machine. So far, friends were so supportive and teachers were so supportive. They, they think they did not bother about me, about my machine. As an Indian child, I was attracted into cricket, but I was very really good in bowling and fielding. So my parents suggested me to go for an individual game playing tennis. So that's why I switched from cricket ball to tennis ball. I loved the game well, but I want to take some challenges. The hearing aids were inconvenient, sweating and irritation in my ears were so annoying and it's difficult to listen what other people are talking to me in insertion in a crowd. Most biggest challenge is talking over the phone with friends or parents or anyone else. Time flew by and I learned the techniques which I got to with to learn some those challenges. The major talk was I felt so sad and I cried that I met an accident in my left forearm at the age of 13 where I played on my tennis court. It took almost 8 months and I underwent 2 surgeries before I came back to the court. But once I am back to the court, the passion for my tennis game grew drastically. At the age of 15, I was so certain that tennis is my life. Uh, I am also saying that whatever parents ask me to do anything, but I will never stop playing tennis. I will keep continuing playing tennis. Doing B.Tech or MBA or job, I did not stop playing tennis. I would like to take some uh, good points where I scored 81% in class 12, the biggest milestone for Indian kids. And also, I graduated B.Tech and MBA with great scores. Hours from tennis game during school and college days definitely boosted my confidence. My most proudest moment was I became the world champion in that category and awarded the best sportsman of the year in 2019. I request you that please consider Indian Deaf Tennis to support uh, para athletics to do the best for you. Thank you. I now invite my parents to share some few words on the stage. Namaste. I am Shekhar Lakshmanan, father of uh, Prithvi. I am a retired chemical engineer. Namaste. I am Gomati Shekhar, mother of Prithvi, a perfect homemaker and a proud mother of two sons, Praveen and Prithvi. Yeah, Praveen and Prithvi gave us a very good time and got, got us engaged uh, throughout their life. And now Praveen is uh, married to Sushmita and settled in USA in a good job. And Prithvi is, uh, as we all know, is a world tennis champion. I think as parents, we could not have asked for anything better than this. Yes, I fondly remember proud Praveen supporting Prithvi in all aspects to bring me up so successful in life. I just wanted a good life for Prithvi to be very confident as though he faced many challenges in life. We put him in an individual sport as he would become very confident and successful in life. What a game started as a passion was very successful in his career, which has become his career now. 
In the beginning, I used to take him for practice daily, noting all his pros and cons, his ups and downs, and discussing with the coach and encouraging him how to do, what not to do, everything. I used to travel locally and outstation for the matches. Is it not, Shekhar? Yeah, I think she was perfectly right. And uh, as responsible parents, we did all that needed, we needed to be done for uh, Prithvi especially. And we, we took care, care of him and brought him up to speed on all his sporting activities. But at the same time, as typical uh, middle class Indian mindset, we threw a lot of challenges at him. We wanted him to study well first and study uh, engineering and study in science group in uh, his schooling and then get a job and get settled in life as quickly as possible. That was our mindset. So we accordingly, we put him in science group. He gladly accepted it without really knowing what science group is at the time. He passed with flying colors with 81 percentage in uh, plus two examination. Then we took him to uh, college and that time he said, I will do engineering only if I am allowed to play, if I can continue to play. And fortunately, he got into SRM. And then when he finished his uh, BTEC MBA in SRM, the biggest challenge was, where do we get a job? Then he said, he was very firm on that, that I will get a job and go to a job where I am allowed to play tennis without a break. And that is why, that's where uh, my wife, Uma, looked at wherever it is, uh, uh, the, the company's offering sporting activities as a career. Then he landed up in Indian Railways, which is ICF at uh, Chennai, and that's where he is put up now. Yes, Mr. Shekhar, it was really a very, very achievement for us. What started as a small game for him as a pastime has become his career now. But each time he surprised us with a lot of laurels. He was a darling to his teacher, to his professor, and to his coaches. The day when he won the world champion, it is really alarming. I thought it was his dream come true day. Is it not, Mr. Shaker? Yeah, I think I still remember the day when he was declared the world champion. But anyway, we can continue to keep talking. There's no, not much time left. I would just like to say, send this message to the parents who have got special children. Let's all remember that special children are really special and they express their attitudes and their patience in so many different ways. And as parents, we should pick up the signals, guide them in the right path, give them what they really need and allow them to succeed. Make, make my words, allow them to succeed. So, Prithvi is a classic example now where he, he, can, he has done, demonstrated that both studies and sports can be done together and done very well together. So, if Prithvi can do it, there are thousands and millions of uh, such talented young uh, persons and children who are across the world can really benefit from this uh, case study. And I wish them all a great, great uh, future ahead. Yes, it is the most important parental support that is required for these children. We need patience. One day or the other, they will really succeed in life. I am really proud that Prithvi has a become a role model for all these para athletic children to come shining in their life. Thank you. Thank you very much for your hearing.